What's going on guys, Tmart here, and welcome back to another episode of Forza Horizon 2. In the last episode, we were checking out the Lambo Huracan, and today we're flipping over, flipping the coin, we're going to be checking out something from Ferrari, yes, that's right, alright, so this is the F12 Berlinetta 2012 edition. These things are, uh, they're pretty sick, they're uh, a little bit unconventional in terms of the shape and stuff for a, uh, a super sports car like this, but uh, they're definitely badass. Like, I, I'm a big fan of these things. They, um, I think they retail for around 300 grand. Uh, starting off, obviously you can, uh, you end up paying more, more for them if you you add on extra packages and stuff. But yeah, around 300 grand, uh, zero to 60 in like three seconds. Like they're a very, very powerful, powerful car. It's just they look a little bit more like a hatchback type deal than uh, than anything else. But they're. Um, are definitely pretty sick, so I was excited to check this thing out. Something a little bit different, it's not like a, a super hyper Pagani and stuff like we're gonna be checking out, but uh, it's something a little bit different. And I wanted to use it because we are gonna be going on a road trip today, boys. Yes, that's right, all right, so let's head this way. We're gonna come out, we're gonna road trip to a new area of the map. We've been here in Nice for quite a while. Whoa, it's very slippery out here today, folks. We're gonna have to be careful not to damage the brand new Rari. Alright, go ahead and flip a Yui right here, and here we go. You okay. guys going to go to Cistron, do you want to go to St. Martin, do you want to go to Castelletto, San Gio, let's go to Cistron, we haven't been to Cistron in a while. And if you all chat, oh no, it was right here, Super GT Championship. We're going to be using our F12 Berlinetta, and let's do this thing boys. Are we ready? Today's first stop is the ancient town of Sisteron. It's a long drive, but that's what we're here for, isn't it? All right, so we've got a nice 8.8 mile drive. We'll be able to test out this F F12 Berlinetta before we get there. Because once we get there, hopefully we're going to be able to get some wins in, baby. So just recently at the Geneva Motor Show, this past week, they actually unveiled a new Koenigsegg. Two new Koenigseggs. There's an Agera version. I forget what it's like. It's like Agera RS or something like that. It's like a new super version of the Agera. And then they also revealed the new Koenigsegg Regera. R-E-G-E-R-A. I'm wondering if it's going to be able to make its way to, uh, to this game for, for DLC. But it's um, $1.9 million. Uh, 0 to 250 miles per hour in 20 seconds, which is just absolutely nuts. And it's a, uh, a, a gas hybrid sports car. So it's half gas, half electric. And full speeds like that. It's absolutely nuts. All right, we're cruising in this thing right now. Let's see what it's like inside. This is pretty, it looks pretty much like a, uh, a 458 in the inside. It's pretty similar. I think this is more of like a, a road trip car. It obviously, it's a Ferrari. It's meant to go fast. It's going to have a, a really nice engine and good, good performance and stuff like that. Ouch! But I feel like this is more of a road trip car. More of a, uh, a comfort car than a race car. It's beautiful, man. Can't believe we lost our... Uh, A score multiplier when we ran in that car. That makes me mad. Oh well. All right. So yeah, we're gonna be traveling to a new area. I'm not sure how much longer to keep this uh, this going. We're gonna go through um, probably at least like another five to ten episodes. We'll keep uh, checking out new cars. You guys are always leaving comments down below the videos and which ones you guys want to see next. And um, it's been going pretty well. We can't keep it going for too much longer though, because Project Cars is coming out here. Uh, today is the fifth, right? So Project Cars. It's actually only 12 days away, less than two weeks away, which is very, very exciting. So not, not next Tuesday, but the Tuesday after that, we're going to be able to check out a new racing game. But you guys know I'm pretty excited about that. But if we would have been able to keep that uh, multiplier going, think about how high it'd be right now. We were able to exit the highway and still stay at a high speed. been at a couple hundred thousand for sure. 
This thing handles super well. At the roundabout, take I'm excited the about using exit. this thing. I don't think we use this in our um, our normal Let's Play. I couldn't remember. Probably should have went back and looked, but I want to check it out anyway, right. so I'm not worried. We had to buy it out of the garage, so I'm assuming we didn't have it. Already have it. Yards, turn right. Excuse me, LaFerrari. Ooh, just blocked him out right there, son. That was great. All right, here we are. Made it to Sisteron. Nothing like a good old 209 mile per hour crash on the way here. <laughs> Let's get it. Welcome to the Super GT Championship. There's some real hot cars signed up for this one. Couple of Astins already. I'm really looking forward to this. Choose a race and we'll get started. All right, sounds good to me. Let's um, here we go, Vitesse Circuit. Let's just go ahead and go for that one. Looks like it's the closest one to us. So here we go, boys. Going to be testing out what the F12s got. First race going to be outside the car. Second race going to be inside. You leveled up. Ooh. We spawn here? Nice. All right. I'll take it. Here we go, boys. Sister on Super GT. Event one out of four. It's a circuit. Ooh. Look at that custom Aston right there. That thing looks insane. Hopefully we're going to be able to keep up. All right, let's get it. We've seen a lot of cars we haven't seen before. All the pictures available. You know, another car I don't think we've used much in this game is Bentley. Have we used any Bentleys in this game? I don't think so. I have to check out some of those. Keep that in mind for your comments what cars you guys want to see. Ooh. Wow. All right. Well, a little bit of a rough start here, but we do have three laps to be able to make up for it. So hopefully we're going to be able to bring it back. We're in ninth place right now. Woo! There we go. Some nice ground there. I don't think we've used any Astons either. We'll definitely have to check those out. I definitely want to get through like the, the major hyper cars, like the Bugattis and, and stuff like that. Oh gosh. We came in way too hard there. Wow, we're two wheeling it. We also got to check out some of the other you know, brands like Alfa Romeo, Aston Martin, Bentley. There are quite a few of them we haven't really tried out. Berlinetta Gang. We haven't really tried out any Mercedes, C63 AMG, SLS, stuff like that. All right, here we go. We're in second place. We're going to quit talking about cars and focus on getting this win. We're going to catch up to Vicstar up here. Here we go, boys. Damn it. All right. This is my first game back in quite a while in this game. I actually, you guys know I went on that cruise like a week ago. This is the first time playing this game since then because I recorded ahead of time. So we're just feeling a little bit... A little bit, uh, a little bit newbie on the sticks here. A little bit rusty. We're gonna be able to bring it back though. I'm coming for you, Vic. Jeez, dude. <laughs> All right, we're gonna make this final lap a clean one, boys. What do you say about that? Nice. Look at that turn. We messed that turn up last time, but we were able to nail it there. All right, clean lap coming up. And we're going to get first place. We're going to slow things down here. Oh, not a clean lap anymore. Well, we'll have a clean lap in terms of walls, I guess. Look at him in that. Is that a... I don't even know what that is. I was going to say, is that a 177? But I don't think it is. Pretty hard right hand turn coming up up here. Yes, 
accelerate to the apex. Woo! He's right on our tail, boys. Feathering the gas a little bit. Shit! Oh gosh. <laughs> I thought we were going to slide a little bit more there, but we just gripped the road. We did not slide at all. We weren't going fast enough. Oh, well, all right. At least we got the first place finish. Can't complain about that, right? Nice driving, mate. Another 20 points. At least we got first. All right. Good stuff. So now, we're going to move on to our next race today. We're going to be racing from inside this bad boy. Hopefully, we can go a little bit better than that last one did. I feel like we... uh. We're a little bit reckless there, so we're gonna try to um, try to see if we can have a little bit better luck here. All right, where are we going? Looks like we got one right up here on the left. Here we go. Even has the shifting lights on the top of the steering wheel, like the four, five, eight. There we go. We're looking pretty good so far inside. All right, here we go. East Park Street Race. Let's see what we're going to be working with here. Two out of four. It's a street race, bros. So I believe this is just going to be a point to point then. Here we go. Oh yeah, it's point to point. Wow, we're ending up back around where we started. There we go. We try to keep it clean. It's kind of hard right at the start not to run into a bunch of people, but we try to keep it clean as we can. Oh yeah, we're looking good, son. I sort of a racing game. I'm sure you can do this. But I want a racing game where you can play on PC with like triple monitors to where you can set it up so you can see like the 45 degree angles, kind of like slightly outside of your windows, the left and right, and then set up like a, uh, a steering wheel and gas pedals and just get like the full racing experience. It'd be fun. It'd be hard to do in videos though. Like that would just be something that would be fun to have on a personal level. Oh, with all that virtual reality stuff coming out, Sony actually just announced their virtual reality product. It looks sweet, but how the heck are you going to make videos with that? <laughs> are you guys going to be watching my virtual reality videos on your virtual reality, reality helmets? Or how is that going to work? I don't know. Can you put that stuff in video form? So I'll have to wait and see. I still think it's pretty far out. Like, Oculus Rift is cool. I've used it a couple of times now. But it's just, um, it's not quite perfect. I don't know. With companies like Facebook and Sony and all these companies working on it, maybe you're not as far out as it seems. It's like, I'm going to be put out of a job, man. That's no fun. <laughs> I just can't wait to those, like, Walking machines are real. You guys see those like it? I think one was on Shark Tank one time. Oh gosh, that's the finish line. Oh! We almost passed him right at the end. I did not realize we were that close to the end. Sitting here talking about virtual reality and stuff. Holy crap. Oh wow, we're still in first place. So we're going to count that as a win in our book. You guys know we typically um, switch up cars and stuff. We want to stay in Sister Run for a little bit since we were uh, in our last destination for quite a while so we're probably going to switch it up to a new class of car in the next episode i'll probably move over to hypercars think about what kind of hypercars you guys would like to see and uh, leave comments for uh for what you guys would like me to use anyway i'll see you guys in the next episode thank you guys so much for watching peace out